Hello, Leon here from BackIntelligence.com where we help people manage their back pain from home as well as help them fix their postures. And in today's video, I'm gonna be uh, giving you some research behind why posture variability may be just the thing that you need in order to decrease some of the back pain and neck pain that you're having. And then I'm gonna show you four ways that you can alter your posture uh, so that you can decrease some of that pain. So yes, you do wanna sit in a good uh, posture at your desk, but you also want to vary your posture throughout the day uh, because sitting statically in one position uh, is not going to be enough. It, it can actually cause you more pain and, and create some tension in the muscles and you know your blood's not going to flow through your body so that's going to create some discomfort and things like that. So you do want to alter your posture throughout the day. Uh, so let's look at some studies that have looked at this. In the first study, they looked at whether uh, introducing intermittent standing uh, throughout the workday would improve the levels of fatigue, musculoskeletal discomfort, and work productivity versus seated work. And what they found here is that transitioning from a seated to a standing work posture every 30 minutes across the day relative to seated work led to a significant reduction in fatigue levels and lower back discomfort in overweight, obese office workers. In another study, they took uh, office workers and they gave them different workstations as well as software reminders to see how it uh, impacts their uh, body and back pain as well as productivity. And what they found is that uh, significant reductions in short-term discomfort were reported in the shoulders, upper back, and lower back. And this is mainly from getting a reminder software that basically uh, pinged them every time to switch and alter positions every so often throughout the day. And also their productivity did not have a negative impact by using this. And now let me give you four ways that you can alter your posture throughout the day. The first one is simply just move in place. As you're sitting down, just start moving. Do the cat and cow, stretch out your arms, uh, you know, wiggle in place. That's already going to go a long way from just sitting in a static position for too long. Secondly, while seated still, you can just simply change your posture, you know, like lean to one side, lean forward for a moment, you know. I don't recommend that you stay in those uh, other positions for too long, but it's good sometimes to kind of, you know, switch and alter your uh, perfect posture from time to time. Next, you want to switch from sitting to standing. Yeah, I would recommend every 30 minutes or so, just, you know, switch back and forth. Uh, in general, there's a lot less compression on your spine when you're standing. So a lot of people feel less uh, discomfort in their low backs by standing up for a while. And you can still work, you're not gonna lose any uh, productivity or anything like that. So just switch between standing and sitting throughout the day. For that, obviously, you'll need a sit and stand Desk. I've done a video where I talked about the benefits of a sit and stand desk. There's going to be a link to it somewhere here in the video or down below in the description. The fourth way to vary your posture is simply to uh, get up and walk around uh, every 30 minutes or so. An easy way to do this is just get a bottle of water that you need to refill uh, every so often. So that will give you an excuse to get up and refill your water, okay? So that's an easy one. Uh, and for that, obviously, just set some uh, reminders on your computer or on, on your phone uh, when the 30 minutes hits. If you can't do 30 minutes, do it at least every 45 minutes or an hour. All right, that's it for today, folks. I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, please give us a like, as well as subscribe to this YouTube channel for more videos just like this. Also, if you'd like to get three posture exercises from uh, Dr. David Oliver, we'd love to send them to you. They focus on fixing that uh, rounded shoulders and forward head posture. If you'd like to get those three posture correction exercises, there's gonna be a link to get them somewhere here in the video or down below in the description. Go to that page, enter your email, and we'll send you those videos right away.